Folks, that's my buddy Chase, and that's what Idolo's does. Incredible pizza. Manja manj. We'll save that for later. Ladies and gentlemen, here he is. Mike Pugliano, fresh off a of boxcar somewhere in western Pennsylvania for Norfolk Southern. <laughs> All right, we already took care of a little high school. Any observations about the weather and what happened last Friday night before we talk a little college? Oh, it was horrible. Horrible. Lightning delays everywhere. I know Liverpool Oak Glen was uh, second half didn't start till 10 15. So, uh, Maybe play factor in some of the losses around the county, but Liverpool won, so I'll take it. Listen, my man Randy's here, who absolutely owns this brand, this location in Glenmore. Glenmore, but let me tell you something. I think for about 10 years consecutive after doing Potter football, when they were down on Lisbon Street, I would always stop off and grab myself a half dozen JoJo's to go. The chicken's great, the pizza's incredible, but those JoJo's, oh, man, my. that's gold. Yeah, it doesn't last night, actually. Yeah, you can afford it. <laughs> All right, here we go. Let's get right to it, some college football. And we're going to do that after we talk to this guy. Come on over here, young man. Here he is. Introduce this guy to the audience. Go ahead. This is Randy, the owner of Vitalos of Glenmore. And, uh, hey, Randy. Hey, Rob. How are you? I'm good, Thanks brother. For in. Listen, you don't understand. I, I really, I just tell this young man, nobody's getting paid. We're not even eating here tonight because we're rolling, folks. We're rolling. But I just like to kind of reconnect with some of the things that really made me who I am and were significant as far as a part of me and also helped to sponsor so many athletic events. Tell me a little bit about the history of Idolos. Now, I know a franchise, I know it's been around a long time, and I know they're still in Lisbon, Ohio, and elsewhere, but how did this whole thing start and who are these people? Well, it started, a uh, gentleman from, he came over from Italy, actually, Idolo Ventura was his name, and he actually started the franchise a little over 50 years ago. And um, he branched out from, uh, they're based out of Canton, Ohio, and he has franchises in Canton. Um, he had in Liverpool, Lisbon, he also even had some down south for a while. Um, so, Idlo has since passed away, but his son Jim still operates the business, and uh, and we see Jim quite often. He gives us some supplies and uh, just a little uh, guidance here and there, and that. So, it's, uh, it's uh, been, we've been in business here. Um, my father purchased the business about 20, well, over 20 some years ago. And it's been a pretty good little business thriving and have a good uh, customer base, very loyal customers, and uh, and uh, we're happy to be here and serve the community. Listen, I love what they do. I could get you some good real estate in Western Pennsylvania, <laughs> so I don't have to drive so far. But man, I got to tell you, these are good people, man. And uh, they got a great, great menu, and I hope that you'll find a little time to head out and stop by and sit down and eat, or just give them a call and let them. Uh, get it to you so you can pick it up and take it home and enjoy it with your familia. We're going to talk a little college football next day with us, your Pratt Pack at Idolo's in Glenmore, Ohio. Beautiful countryside. You know your Pratt Pack just loves it.